Hello. Okay, so hello. This is Anastasia Lublina. She is marketing industry lead in the company uh, Intelias. And we are going to start discussion about her experience and uh, the view uh, about IT in a, uh, a review. Yeah. Hi, Sergey. Nice to meet you. Thanks for inviting me here. It's a okay. pleasure to share my thoughts. This, uh, this way, I would like to uh, ask you about your uh, job histories and job position, what, what you had, for example, in the IT area. Yeah, that's a nice question. Thank you. And thank you for uh, just meeting me here at this perfect place. Amazing <laughs> so place. It's a pleasure, yeah. So uh, basically, uh, I'm in IT now uh, for six years. And um, like my job history started very suddenly. When I came to some company, uh, I wanted to be a project manager or sales manager or whatever. Uh, but not but in IT. Uh, in IT. In IT. In IT. Okay. And they uh, just suggested me to become a marketing manager. Because uh, that company, uh, former uh, name was Core Value, and now everybody knows that company as Avenga. So I came there, and uh, just the former Core Value, yeah, they started to build a marketing department in there. Mm -hmm. So that's why uh, they saw uh, something creative in me, and the owner of that company, uh, he suggested me on my interview for PM <laughs> okay. to become a marketing. <laughs> and that was so funny. Basically, and um, I was thinking of it, and then I decided to uh, like, yeah, to say yes, guys, let's try because that's something creative. There are a lot of communications, uh, like there is like always something new and interesting, you know, in that sphere. So uh, that was uh, like basically the beginning of the story of my marketing. Uh, in IT. Yeah. And uh, I heard that now I'm working for another company and you yeah. are the head of marketing or something like that. Yeah, I'm like marketing lead, uh, like uh, industry lead, uh, mm -hmm. we can call it as uh, in my company and my position sounds. So uh, that's Intelius, uh, the name of the company. Uh, they are uh, basically like, uh, like in Ukraine, mm -hmm. like I mean Ukraine and IT company, uh, but they have offices like uh, across the world. Also, uh, and they're quite big company. So yeah, I decided to move uh, forward from Avenga to another place uh, just for my own self-development, something interesting, something new. And uh, yeah, so now basically I, I'm like driving uh, the specific industry vertical, so we can call it like vertical-based marketing uh, in the world. Yeah, so that, that's quite interesting for all marketers like, okay, uh, and to be focused. On yes, something. and what are your main activities? For example, your daily task or what are you doing? Yeah, so uh, basically most of my uh, job like it consists from uh, calls. Oh, of <laughs> like, course, all like in IT. <laughs> yeah, like in IT. So that's how IT is working. <laughs> and yeah, and plus uh, on top of that, uh, like there are also uh, a lot of interesting stuff about researching, strategy, uh, like building some uh, uh, real like uh, business analysis strategies, how to drive and how to bring uh, even more uh, like uh, clients from specific mm -hmm. industry all over the world. Like uh, I'm now like uh, leading uh, agriculture uh, industry for uh, Benelux uh, region and UK. Okay, and so, uh, for example, the business language is uh, English? Yes, that's English and German. German, okay. Yeah. And because I know that you are speaking German as well, yeah, but, yeah. but primarily is English. Primarily is English as the company's language is English. Uh, like uh, all across the workers and uh, we also have like uh, people in Germany mm -hmm. and offices in Germany but uh, as for me like mostly I speak English in there yeah. okay and for example about your business trips you are going to Germany or to Benelux or... Uh, not yet but I think yeah I, I will come as um, yeah they have many offices and you know uh, some of our part of the teams uh, they are in Germany for example sales and uh, business development uh, department so they are based in Germany yeah. and maybe could you tell us about uh, some products of Intelias what are working on and so on yeah so basically uh, it's not like product-based company it's like an outsourcing company okay. uh, like SoftServe, like Avenga, like Epam, uh, something like this but not so large yet mm -hmm. So, uh, and basically, yeah, they have uh, a lot of the clients all over the world and um, like the focus on auto automotive mm -hmm. industry uh, because uh, they, they, like uh, we were started from automotive industry, so they have a lot of clients in there and BMW, Volvo and something like that. 
Yeah, and yeah, so basically it's just kind of outsourcing. So we do uh, like um, different, I don't know, uh, like solutions. The cloud solutions, data solutions, I mean like a solution engineering company. Oh, okay. Yeah, mostly so, yeah, that's it. That's that's the focus. And for example, uh, many people or many young people wanted to work, for example, in IT or they, they don't know because they are are young. Uh, so maybe the question, why, why, why do you think or what do you think, uh, why is good to work in IT? Especially, for example, in a company that it's like, it's developing some products or some application or something like that. Yeah, that's uh, basically a good question. And uh, as for me, like why I chose yeah IT industry because uh, as of me, like I really love communication with uh, different cultures, different people across the world. So uh, that was kind of hobby uh, for me, uh, and uh, that's why like IT people, uh, they know they are very modern, they are very like communicating, they are interesting. And they are like, I don't know, they're just uh, creative people, you know, and uh, everything is uh, like pacing and changing a lot in there. And, and this, you know, like energy, this active life, this is what I love. So um, I would recommend like uh, to go to IT only if uh, you want, you know, self-development, you want to increase yourself, like, yeah. Is, that, that's great. In, in night you can find a lot of opportunities for um, a lot of jobs, for example, yes. And for example, about Lviv, what can you tell us about the IT cluster or IT companies in Lviv? Because I, I saw that there's maybe 215 IT companies here from all the world. And what is the IT life here in, in Lviv? That's also a good question. As uh, you know, like um, like we think, like uh, like it's um, not even we, but uh, like. There is uh, the most IT community is located in Lviv, mm -hmm. like if we talk about Ukraine. So uh, that's why like there are many companies uh, who want uh, to have, uh, I mean, um, like international companies, they want to have office uh, in Lviv mm -hmm. because here are a lot of uh, really cool developers, uh, really people, uh, they are very professional uh, and not only developers, I mean, they, like just, they know that Lviv is a very perfect location because it's close to Europe. Uh, it's cheaper than Europe. Uh, it, 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 like uh, we have really nice developers, nice people uh, with perfect experience. And uh, yeah, of course, like in Lviv, uh, you can find, as you mentioned, like uh, IT cluster. Uh, we have uh, really this name, this specific name for IT community of uh, Ukraine. The name is IT cluster. But uh, they are like you know located in Lviv, Kiev, Kharkiv, and like for example Lviv IT cluster, Kiev okay. IT cluster, Kharkiv IT cluster, and Odessa, and others. So uh, that is like um, I would say it, it was like kind of private community, but now they became like um, they are cooperating with government. Oh, okay. On uh, like high level government, so uh, they built you know uh, all that IT solutions, IT G digital solutions uh, like for Ukraine. And that's perfect because government uh, supports a lot of the IT uh, initiatives. That's good because when government is supporting, it's the best yeah. way to to develop. Or, Absolutely. Uh, yes. So that. Yeah. And what about, for example, some funny stories in your job? Because I think that you have to have because uh, <laughs> you are working there six years, I think, yeah. in IT. So and with the people from from the Europe, so what about funny stories? Oh, there are a lot of funny stories actually, just to remind a few, uh, there were like um, one fuck up, I would say, in my, in my story, uh, when just uh, we were working for uh, one American client and uh, just something changed in our like uh, SOV or services agreement here with the client and uh, the client like wanted us to delete all mentions and all logos of this client on our website and everywhere like mm -hmm. because we were a tea vendor for that client and uh, that was kind of a cup for uh, me personally and my team and uh, we just forgot to move one logo okay. <laughs> from somewhere and the client found that logo and <laughs> yeah that was very big for company. <laughs> yes, but it, I think it was not so funny for for, yes. for you or for the company. Yes, but it, but now you know when I re remind remember this story, it's now funny. But that time was not funny because uh, the owner of the company uh, called to me in the night <laughs> oh, yeah. and said, "Nastya, oh my God, please delete the logo. The client is going like to the judge." <laughs> yes, but he was and then he was friendly. I think. Or, or not, so, okay. <laughs> not so. The client was so 
about it because yeah, you know, it's something that I will remember like <laughs> all my life because yeah, that was kind of funny for cup. <laughs> okay. So yeah. And what's your, for example, plan? <clears throat> Plans for next uh, months, next years? Uh, in, actually, in, in, in business, I think. In business, yeah. So um, I think I will just uh, work hard because uh, I really like and love what I do. Uh, I'm a fan of marketing, I'm a fan of strategy and uh, I like to, I don't know, make some kind of uh, experiments, you know, trying some uh, new channels, trying some new stuff in marketing as it's always changing and um, like you can never find, uh, I don't know, like it's interesting how marketing works because uh, like for example, uh, if you know one marketing channel, it can work for one kind of client, but it cannot work for another. So that's why you you, you should uh, like kind of experiment, mm -hmm. you know. So and yeah, I'm just going to experiment like further, uh, trying some creative stuff and uh, working with the team and see how it goes. And, and for example, in your company where I'm working right now, it's possible to have some trainings. Yeah, people. absolutely. There are a lot of trainings, a lot of learning stuff, and I, I'm learning like every day. It's like kind of university <laughs> for me, I would say. So it's very interesting and challenging. Okay, Nasta, thanks a lot for your time, and uh, I wish you all the best in your in your personal and your business life, and I hope uh, we will see us uh, next uh, next part of this uh, yeah. these discussions. Thank you, Sergey. Yeah, it was nice to talk to you. So yeah. Enjoy, enjoy your next meetings, yeah, and good luck.